Today, I'm gonna be spending 100 days in One Piece Minecraft. On day one, I spawned into the server of Mind Piece. I had to figure out where things were since everything was customized on the server. But I had one goal in mind, to become the Pirate King. So first, let's find some crew members. Um, would you like to join my crew? I'm not gonna fall around some like little weak guy. Go punch oh, that guy. Let's see what okay, you do. Yeah, yeah. Let's see what you can do. I'll prove my strength, I'll prove my strength. What? Come on, don't die. Come on. And yes, there we go. See, I'm strong. Uh, okay, okay, fine. I'll join, I'll join. And just like that, me and my best friend Zoro started to defeat the rest of the pirates. And when things were looking good, someone else decided to join us. But who is this? Hey, fellas. Can I come? Uh, his haircut is pretty stupid. Whoa, 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 whoa. Of course you can join the crew. And just like that, I had my crew all sorted out. Did he just die? Yeah, it might just be us two for right now. He's, uh, he the <laughs> he's a little weak. I'm not gonna lie. Okay. All right, guys, let's open one. Ooh. Wait. Oh. Wait. What did I get? I got some green ball that swirled in my face. Oh, me too. For the next couple days, me and my crew decided to explore Fushit Town. But that's when we realized that this is not the island we wanted to live on. So we did what any pirate king would do. Take over a whole island just for ourselves. I cleaned up the island just a little bit, and I went back to Fushit Town to complete my missions. Now, Fusha is just Island 1, and to move on to Island 2, we have to defeat the final boss of Fusha. So, me and the crew started fishing to grind XP, which isn't really the most efficient ways, but we had some memorable times. So, what kind of fish is y'all's favorite to eat? I'm, I'm a tuna guy. I like tuna. Yeah, we got bored of fishing pretty quickly, so we went to go slay some bandits to prepare for the final boss. On day 11, it was time. Alright, crew, let's fight the boss. Hello? Um, guys? Did they both leave me? Well, I guess I have to fight the boss myself. Oh. Oh my gosh. Okay. Oh. Okay. Block that. Oh! Oh my god. 5 HP? Okay. We're getting there. Our, our shield is slowly depleting. Oh! He summons! What? Where did all these bandits come from? This isn't fair. It's like a 6v1. Rewards to claim. <laughs> what do you mean rewards to claim? Can't you see I'm in the middle of a boss fight? Oh, okay, I did it. Okay, last boss. Okay, block the first hit. Come on, hit me. Yes. Come on, yes. Boom, yes. There we go. We, I don't need any crewmates. After defeating the boss of the first island, I ranked up and moved on to the next island. Okay, we finally made it to Orange Town. And the moment I landed my boat, pirates started attacking me already. Oh, bro, that guy did so much damage. Oh, no, my shield. Oh, we're good. Okay, after defeating the pirates guarding the island, I headed into town to open some crates. Okay, let's open one of them. What do we get? A whip. This whip was insanely strong. I used it to defeat enemies all over the island. However, when I finished farming potatoes, I went back to the shops and I did this. I sold my weapon? Yeah, so instead of selling the potatoes, I sold the whip. So I had to go back using a sword. Ooh, okay, so I got a pet. I don't know what this is, but let's just click it. And what do we get? Oh my god, it's so cute. Okay. Now, does it, does it help me? Okay, yeah, no. After losing my whip and having a pet, that doesn't really help me in battle. I think it's time for me to get my first devil fruit. I mean, I don't know what I'm gonna get, but we're gonna, we're gonna try this out. All right, let's spin. Let's see what devil fruit we can get. This is our first devil fruit. Come on. It, oh, blue. What'd I get? Oh, I, got, I got a rare. Boom, there we go. We did a frost fruit. All right, let, let's consume it. And boom, okay. So now we have, oh, oh, and, oh, and he died. This might actually be good. With my new devil fruit, I still back to Orange Town, but then this happened. Uh, hello? Well, what does this guy want? Why are you in leather? Well, what do you mean why am I in leather? Just when I thought I was a bit stronger, I got embarrassed and my confidence went kind of down. So this is not going to go well. I decided to challenge Doge Waffle, which, yep. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm still weak. So I went back to spawn to open some crates. And I finally got another shield, which is going to make my life a whole lot easier. So I took my shield and devil fruit back to Orange Town to defeat this mini boss. Yeah, yeah, well... Okay. Come on, just die. Oh, I, I did it! And for the next couple days, I defeated a whole bunch of pirates and completed as many missions as I can to prepare myself for buggy. Okay, I think it's buggy time, and yes, again, it's it's just me. Oh, okay, honestly, that looks so cool. Whoa, whoa, he has range attacks? Wait, he has so much range. Oh, wait, he can dodge my attacks too? Where did all these pirates come from? Okay, after the first boss, I was expecting some kind of summoning, but <laughs> I'm about to die. No, oh, no, I died. Okay, after a couple of days of grinding buggy balls, we finally have enough to fight buggy once again. But first, let's open some crates. Okay, well, I guess we can open this one. Ooh, we got Zoro. Okay. Another one, why? <laughs> Another Zoro. 
Let's do a another Zoro. Here we go, and... Yeah, so, I just got a whole bunch of Zoros. But, oh, it's so cute! With my new Zoro pet, I was so confident, I went straight in to fight Buggy. Okay, here we go again. Let's make sure I block the first initial hits. Okay, there we go. Alright, let's smack him. Boom. Yep. Okay, he should summon- Whoa, he just attacked Zoro! Chill out! Okay, yeah, he has all his pirates. What? Yeah, yes, yes! Okay, we're good. Bro, this weapon low-key carried me. It was definitely worth the upgrade. I didn't even need a devil fruit, to be honest. And boom! Oh, 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 oh. wait. Why he... Oh, oh, hey, there we go. He dodged like two of my abilities. That scared me for like a, a, a couple seconds. But we did it. And now it is currently one to one between me and Buggy. So I went in for the third time to defeat him once again. Dodge that, and he's gonna throw another one. Oh, and there we go. <laughs> We have defeated Buggy. Nice. By defeating Buggy 2-1, we have now unlocked the final island in this 100-day journey. So I packed up my things and I headed out to sea. And I arrived at this restaurant in the in the middle of the ocean. There we go. Wh where have you been? You left me to die <laughs> on the beginner island and now you're, you're just here eating food. That's cool. No, I, I see how it is. Not only did you leave me, you gave me a whole bunch of quests to complete. Ah. <sighs> I then headed down into the restaurant and there was people already hungry. You don't have a meal? Oh my goodness. Okay, cook your dishes here. Okay, this is the kitchen. Okay, I, I, I can work with this. So after exploring the whole island, I had one thing left to do. To catch fish. A lot of fish. However, while I'm catching the fish, a boss spawns in the middle of Orange Town. So you know how to participate. Oh, no, who is this? Did I just get sat frozen? Wait, he stole my devil fruit basically. Okay, he's almost dead and there we go. I was the fifth most damage, okay. I didn't really get that much money. I got tired of fishing, so I went to go complete my other quests. While I was trying to figure out how to make food, I remembered something. While I was watching a comment, this happened. Oh, that was joking, but there actually is. I had to find out if this was true or not. All right, let's see if it's here. Is there actually... Oh, okay. I Yeah, uh, I, I don't know what else I expected. I went back to the kitchen to cook up all the fish that I got, and it was finally time to feed the customers. Right, what's the, what is that? Oh, I have one. Okay, here you go. Ooh, 200 silver pans? I'll, I'll take that, I'll take that. What is this? No problem. A another one? Really? really? That this is the last one I have. Oh, I have that. Okay. There you go. I I don't have any more of those. I I'm sorry, we are out. I don't have that, I don't think. Yeah, that that's, a that's the only one I don't have. So, uh... Bro, two of them? Uh, okay, we might have to restock. <laughs> um, yes, we do have one of these. This is the legendary lobster. Here you go, sir. And after feeding a bunch of customers, I only had a few dishes left. So I needed to catch more fish. But first, we need to upgrade our fishing rod so we can get better catches. Hopefully, I can get the cook's fishing rod. This is all I want, okay? That's all I want. 2,000 frying pans each. I got it! Yes! <laughs> yes, yes, yes! We can restock on fish with this. So I went to go fishing, and I cooked up a whole bunch of new dishes for the customers. Okay, we have restocked, and people already want the lobster. Okay, here we go. Here you go problem what is this the soup i got you bro this is my last lobster okay well we did the quest okay i'll take that after feeding enough customers i was given a mission luffy we need your help luffy wait who, who is this this is not the sanji i knew there's a sea monster attacking the restaurant please help us bring me back its heart and i'll reward you now fighting a sea monster with just the whip was not gonna be enough so i tried my luck opening crates and i got this on the first try yep, I oh Okay, I got a full body sword, which was an upgrade, but I couldn't tell how much damage it would be increased. Since I had some leftover silver, I decided to open another one. Ooh, we got a new fruit. All right, let's switch fruits. Let's see what this, this one does. Okay, okay, so we go up in the sky and then we slam down. Now this devil fruit might have been useful for the other two bosses since they would have summoned minions. But for the sea monster, it's just one target. So I decided to just go back to the frost. Okay, before fighting the sea monster, let's get some new armor. This diamond armor is about to break, and I'm pretty sure this armor is just better. So, there we go. Alright, let's switch the armor. Oh, okay. I look way cooler, and I get a lot more health. So, yeah, this armor is definitely going to help us. <laughs> Bro, this hat is so big. Let's fight the sea monster. Okay, I'm a little bit scared. Where? Where's... Oh, okay, there it is. Oh, he looks scary, bro. Okay. Oh. Bro, how am I supposed to hit this guy? Okay, okay. We got hit in. We got a hit in. Okay, okay. Okay. Well, we got two hits in. 
Oh, he's half HP? Yes. Okay. This is kind of easier. I'm not gonna lie. This armor is saving me right now. All right, let's try out Devil Fruit. Oh, okay. I don't think our Devil Fruit is gonna do anything. That thing just went straight through him. Okay, ow. Yep. Ow. Ow. Oh, he's so calm. Bro, this guy's like teleporting. It's so weird to hit him. And wait. Come to okay, here we go. Here we go. Boom. Yes, there we go. We defeated the sea monster. And with that, we got the sea monster's heart. So I went back to Sanji to give it back to him. 